the likes of Marco Antonio Barrera, Eric Morales, Oscar De La Hoya, Miguel Cotto, also Ricky Hatton. Truly a murderer's row. And defeated Juan Manuel Marquez, had memorable confrontations against Morales and Marquez. Truly really remarkable. Eight division world champion Manny was right after DKU. DK with a straight left. Manny smiles at him. To the size advantage from DKU. Manny attacks the body of DKU, and that'll conclude the first round. Manny Pacquiao, DKU. Round number two, this one is scheduled for six. We'll see if Manny decides to unload a straight left. And, you know, DKU, you know, he threw a couple of jabs, and he said that he thinks that his unique martial arts style could give Manny Pacquiao difficulty. So far in the first round, that was not to be the case. Manny Pacquiao return 44 on December 17th. There was a straight left that missed. Good movement by DKU. Ooh, good there he goes. By Manny. He landed. Manny landed that left, and he attacks the body of DKU under a minute to go in our second frame. Manny is sort of planting his feet more. Typically, he's sort of moving more side to side, trying to get on the inside and on court. But I really wonder here at 160, you know, how he's feeling. He probably understood that he's got to come in heavier because of the fact that DKU was going to weigh in in a higher weight. No, he's not the, he's not the same age he was before, so you think, never know. Yeah, and I think Manny can really, he, he knows he can explode in with speed whenever he wants, but it's an exhibition fight. I don't think Manny wants to, you know, hurt, hurt DK too badly too early in the fight, so I think he's kind of just taking his time with it because he knows eventually he's going to get close to DK no matter what. He's not looking to unload that. Signature shot, one of those big bombs that put Pete Thurman on the can enter into the third round. He's a well-respected fighter. A legendary, iconic, and will no doubt have his place in the International Boxing Hall of Fame. 100%. But for DKU, what a learning experience this is for him to be able to have the biggest moment of his career. There's a left there by you. He threw something. That was probably the strongest punch that he threw. A glancing shot for you. We'll see if Manny decides to tag him and he grips the body. Good straight left by Manny. Manny engages in a bow. Boy, you don't see that every day. Still blinding fast. He's so nice. He's so polite. I love it. He's been like all fight week. He was just so kind to everyone. No doubt about it. Typically, Manny's the nice one inside the ring. I think DK may have him beat. Right? Who's nicer? <laughs> Under a minute one. left here in the third, but let's not forget it is still prize fighting. And they both are trying to inflict some damage upon one another. Ray Flores, Amir Tyson, the champ. Sinisa Super Bad Estrada here in Seoul, South Korea, the main event of Triller Fight Club. Happy holidays to all of you and your families. The return of the great Manny Pacquiao against DKU. A couple of lefts hammering away upon DKU, and you wisely says, no, 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 let me tie up and sort of extend the time. I love, I love when Manny goes to the body and just goes blinding fast to the head. Like, it's, oh, it's, good, it's crazy. Good right hook up top by Manny. Ooh, yeah, let's Manny go, the Manny. Right hook. Manny picking up the intensity. DKU looked over at the big screen to see how much time he has left in this, our third round. Well, Manny has picked up the pace, as you pointed out, Sinisa. Ooh, ooh. Couple of lefts there. Lancing shots, but round three is drawn to a close. ...victory in which he captured the welterweight championship of the world, so that is why I am referring back to that, yes. and he did it into his 40s. I'm not trying to pick on Keith Thurman whatsoever. <laughs> Or actually signal out, single out one particular fight. Round four is scheduled for six. Manny Pacquiao, DKU. I think it's clear that if Manny wants to turn up the intensity, it's awfully hard for DKU to try to match that. Oh, yes, and DK won't be able to keep Manny off of him. I mean, it's all in the feet, and 
as the rounds go on, DK's getting um, more and more winded, and that means his legs are, are going with him. And his legs are going to be the first to go. There's that right hook upstairs by Manny Pacquiao, and you really wonder if Manny is trying to go and really sort of end it in grand fashion. Manny looking to swarm one DKU. DKU and, looks visibly tired. He's breathing heavy. Well, when you yes. get hit to the body by Manny Pacquiao, it'll take some wind out of your sails. Yeah, and as I was going to say before the replay, you can train for any other sport. You could you could train for martial arts as well and think that you're in great condition. But when you step into a boxing ring and you have to go by the boxing rules. Oh, there's a right hook. For DKU, that was probably his best punch of the fight. Going by boxing rules and boxing technique and having to stick to that, it's exhausting. Look at that. Manny Pacquiao coming into your living rooms there. Our cameraman was sort of taken aback. Anyone will get fatigued fighting Manny Pacquiao. Man. My dad always, always told me, he said, it's different between boxing shape and being in shape. It's just totally different thing. Yes. Manny and DKU goes down and they're ruling it a slip. So says our referee in charge as we near the conclusion of our fourth round. I think DK is sort of trying to prolongate some time. And there is, and down goes DKU. And this one is... Yeah, DKU is breathing heavy. And I think it is only a matter of time. Will Manny elect to show some restraint or will he go after PKU? You was moments away from being stopped, but he likes to come out and he gets hammered with that left. Now he's got a little bit of an alley shuffle. Okay, this is the most lively we've seen DKU. We'll see if that martial arts and the fans certainly making some noise. Manny has him in circles. That is hilarious. Well, DK's got to do something, and he's getting hammered with that left. There's a right hook followed by a straight left. It's moments away from possibly being wow. stopped. Manny Pacquiao hammered away upon DKU. And he warns Manny Pacquiao about hitting behind the head. Okay, so that'll extend round number five. Okay, so I think DKU was trying to prolong some time. Yeah, definitely. And now Manny Pacquiao going right after DKU. DKU can barely remain upright. Manny's going. I think Manny wants to finish this off. He wants the rest out of the way. from Manny Pacquiao. And now they are wrestling here. I think DK is just trying to kill the clock here. He's in pure survival mode and has been since the fourth round when he was knocked down at the end of the fourth, stayed down, and just wants to go the distance. Speaking of the clock, what? Oh, there it is. <laughs> That's not like a five minute round. To the finish, so this next 120 seconds may seem like an eternity for DKU. I think DKU. DKU's trying to be nice to Manny. Well, he Manny won't knock him out. <laughs> he hugged Manny Pacquiao and he killed four seconds. I think DKU's trying to find a way to survive. Will Manny Pacquiao allow him to do so? Now they are resting, jostling for position. He's going for a single leg takedown to no avail and pounded on by Manny Pacquiao will he be able to go the distance with the eighth division world champion Manny Pacquiao I know Manny wants to he wants to make him quit he wants to get the stop now he's back against the corner a couple of laps Manny driving DK oh my god DKU on a shot from Manny Pacquiao survive these final 49 seconds and now why is time being called and now we continue will Manny Pacquiao be able to get the finish in my estimation the fight should have been waved off a round ago now DK trying
trying to give one last push. Ooh. Oh, big right big hook push. upstairs by Manny Pacquiao. Manny Pacquiao showing his technical superiority Ooh. and glimpses at times of his career. Down goes DKU again. The monster, I love it. And he rolled it a slip. Are you kidding me? Well, in the words of Gloria Gaynor, DK uses the mindset of, I will survive, and he does so. Manny won every single run. Well, Manny Pacquiao hammered away upon DKU whenever he wanted. He was knocking him down and literally beat him from pillar to